Hey guys, Dr. Lara here. Today I'm here with Stormy. Stormy is a three-year-old uh, Norwegian outcome, and Stormy is here today for her rabies vaccine. The main topic is going to be um, rabies tags, um, and just so that Stormy doesn't get too scared or anything like that, she's here with her big brother, Stryker. Um, he is also a Norwegian outcount. And so, um, the rabies tags uh, is typically something that is uh, in the shape of, at least here in Dade County, uh, or Broward County rather, um, it can be in the shape of a bell, sometimes it's in the shape of a, of a, a bone or a heart. And what that is, is to let people know that your dog has been registered um, with the county that you're residing in uh, as having received a vaccination for rabies. Um, it does typically cost money to go ahead and get a rabies tag. Um, here, typically, it'll cost $30 for a dog that is spayed or neutered, and then typically $60 for a dog that is not spayed or neutered. The county is going ahead and charging more for, for dogs that are not spayed or neutered to try and go ahead and get you guys to go ahead and spay or neuter your animals. Um, the, I anticipate that the funds most likely go to the county to help with the dog catchers um, and that kind of stuff. Um, the other thing that we wanted to discuss, obviously, is rabies the vaccine. And so the rabies the, va the disease and the vaccine is one of the two vaccines that I would consider a core vaccine and is also considered a core vaccine by the American Animal Hospital Association. Um, and so rabies is something that is typically transmitted um, through bites. Um, it is something that is very uncommonly seen in pets nowadays in the United States, uh, most likely tied to the fact that so many of the pets uh, are vaccinated for rabies that it prevents the transmission and the spread of that particular disease. The uh, most common animal, domestic animal in the United States to have uh, rabies is um, cats and so but that's not necessarily saying that they're cats that uh, are pets now the other thing to know is that there are some different rabies vaccines there's a one-year rabies vaccine and there's a three-year rabies vaccine and and there are tags that are good that can go with both either the one-year rabies tag or the three-year rabies tag um, I used to give the one year, the three year rabies vaccine. Um, I did see some more allergic reactions to the rabies vaccine. So I personally give the one year rabies vaccine. Um, the other thing that I did want to let you know, just in terms of some statistics, um, there are about 55,000 to 100,000 people worldwide who do end up getting rabies. Um, and the majority of those cases are in Asia and Africa. Um, there are typically, there's that post exposure uh, rabies prophylaxis. And what that typically consists of is getting a series of injections um, after you've been exposed. It is something that is really important to go ahead and see a medical health healthcare professional if there is any concern whatsoever. Um, if you've been bitten by an animal that potentially did have rabies or you're not sure of their rabies status. Um, rabies is a virus that will attack the neurologic system. So um, that's why you might see them drooling or acting weird because that's just not something that is, um, that it's the nervous system of the brain is being affected. And it is something that typically will happen pretty quickly within about 10 days from the time that the pets start acting sick, uh, they will pass away or the animals will pass away. Um, other than that, normally here, we try to get the rabies vaccine in the right rear thigh, um, which Stormy will be receiving today. Um, the reason we give it on the right rear thigh is so that way, if there is any sort of rabies, uh, if there's any sort of reactions to the vaccine, we can go ahead and try and isolate it to which particular vaccine it was, was the one that caused it. Um, otherwise, uh, we'll give other vaccines in different spots. Um, again, if you guys have any questions about rabies or uh, rabies vaccinations or rabies tags, please give, leave them in the comment box. If you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and share. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and be safe.